This is a year eight microbes and genetics video and we're now looking at the genetics part of the topic and here we are looking at variation. Now there's two different ways that uh, we can get variation. One is genetic, so uh, features that we inherit from our parents and the other is a result of our environment. Okay, So some of those things, as you can see from this picture, from our Venn diagram there, are controlled by both. Um, we'll talk about those in a second. Some of them are purely genetic or purely environmental, okay? So, genetic. If you have freckles, it is genetic. It's very hard to um, have freckles if you weren't born with them. Um, also, tongue rollings. This is where you can curl your tongue up. Very hard to learn how to do that. It is a genetic trait. And also, blood type. Features that we get from our environment are things that happen to us during our life, okay? We're not born being able to speak and our accent is developed by the people that we listen to and how they speak. If we were to get a scar or a tattoo, that is something that in, is um, part of us as a result of things that have happened to us. So if we've fallen and we've cut ourselves and got a scar, it does not mean that when we have children, they will be born with the same scar, okay? So it's not something that is genetic and can be passed on. There are several features and we can have lots of different uh, discussions here and debates on, on things that can go in the both category. We are born with our natural skin and hair color but we could use hair dye, our hair could be bleached by the sun, um, skin colour, similarly we could go on a sunbed, we could get a suntan, okay? So some of those features are purely genetic, some are purely environmental, and some can be influenced by both of those different types of variation. Hope you found that useful, thank you.